Hello everyone and welcome to Power Apps Portals Tips. My name is Nicholas Hayduk and this is tip number 47. Creating pages in the new Power Apps Portals Maker experience. As part of the shift from Dynamics 365 Portals to Power Apps Portals, Microsoft has been significantly investing in a new authoring experience. In this tip, I'll show you how to create new pages in the new Maker experience. After clicking the Edit button on your portal from make.powerapps.com, you should see the New Page button in the top left corner. Clicking on that button will present you with a choice of layouts. Selecting one of the layouts from the main list, which in this case includes blank and landing page, will create a web page that uses the default Studio template page template. This page template is essentially blank. The layout you choose will then pre-populate the copy section of your web page to give you the desired layout, which you can then edit. You also have the ability to select a fixed layout, which includes any page templates you've created using web templates. Once you select your layout, the page is created with a default name and URL, which you can then customize. You can also change the page template if you so choose. Pages added using the New Page button are added as children of the home page. You can also add pages as children of other pages by opening up the Pages area in the left-hand navigation, right-clicking on a page, or using the Ellipsis button and selecting Add a Child Page. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Power Apps Portals tip number 47 on creating pages in the new Power Apps Portal Maker experience useful.